Hello. Hello, Ipe. Hello, my friends. How are you? I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. So today, I am going to be doing some cow nails. I got the bright idea to do some cow nails. I was looking through a, my phone and I got inspired by a cow that I took a picture with. So we're here to do some cow nails. They're not going to be your typical cows. Who's excited to see the moo? The moo moo moo. I love cows too. So I mean, I ended up shaving down um my my color as well, like the French, because I need to practice it. I need to do more Frenchies. Um, please, anyone had to update TT? TikTok? What do you mean? I didn't update anything. Fun fact, I own an account in Mexico. <laughs> cool. So because this video, I'm going to upload it to my YouTube channel. I was like, you know what? I need to start from scratch, from no French, because... Um, they need to see that full process. And I need to practice my Frenchie, so what better way? Alrighty, so the only thing that I hate is that I get dirty all the time with my gel. So let's see. I find that doing the Frenchies this way is so much easier than the A shape. So, just in case you guys struggle with Frenchies, because I sure do, try it this way. I'm so excited for my cow nails. Moo. Moo. Moo, la vaca. Moo, la vaca. Moo. Mm -hmm. I should put that song as my set. So I am using my gel polish number 21. Um, I, I'm just using the gel polish this time. Ain't nobody got time to be mixing shit. Hi, from Modesto. Hey. I shall become a French professional by the end of the year. Raise your hand if you have done cow nails before. I think I want French on Friday. Judith, get out of here. <laughs> Fuck it, fuck it. I'm down. I'm practicing here. Fuck it. If I don't practice, I ain't gonna get better, huh? All right, Judith. I'll do your Frenchies. No más porque. I'm gonna be a. No más porque once I I make these like extra perfect, te voy a subir el precio, amiga. 
Right? Look at the pinky. I did it off camera because... Because no mommy is that fucking finger is hard to do. All right, let me put this in my lamp. I'm going to put it in my new, my new lamparita for 60 seconds. I mean, well, let me refill. Wait, never mind. You're like, ya no lo quedo. So let me refill my white here. So I'm going to be doing... Oh, I can't tell you. I can't tell you yet. It's a secret. What the fuck? It turned off already? Why is my lamp not on? What the fuck, bitch? I thought you were charging this whole time. So apparently my lamp is not charged. So I have to use my old one. Hold on. Yeah, I put matte top coat on my nails already. Add a matte top coat before joining the French girl. Life saver. Um, I, I put a matte top coat. I just didn't do it on the live because that's going to take me longer. So you're not, you're doing moo moo nails? Yes, ma'am. I want to do myself a 3D cow with little udders and everything. What? I never heard of that. I need to try that. What we doing? What we going to cook today, mommy? We're not going to cook today. We're doing my... I'm going to do some cow nails. And I'll probably do a 3D cow, depending on how time is. Alright, so next nail. So I'm gonna do all my nails in French only because I don't know. They're all eventually gonna be French, but they're gonna be cow cow. Zule, what did you do with our food from last night? Aquí está. Look, guys, we made this yesterday. I haven't posted it or nothing. We made a hamburger chilito, una pincha ice cream. Yun chilorio. So last time I tried um, the base coat first instead of matte, but definitely I could see why the matte is recommended because it just glides on so much better since it has like a soft finish. So let's see. What happened to your cherries? I took them off. Because I had another idea. I saved the cherries though. So don't think they went to waste. I saved them. We had fun. Yeah, the cherries were really cute. I love them. I did not want to take them off, but I was like, girl, we got a cow to be making. You guys are going to love these cow nails. I had been wanting to do these for a long time. Um, but I forgot. I forgot about these stupid cow nails. Until I was going through my phone, I was like, oh my God, I was supposed to do that. So I went to a restaurant last year and they had this cow right there. And normally I take pictures of things that I'm, that inspire me. So I also took a picture of something at Ross the other day. And I was like, okay, girl, we're going to make nails out of that. And if you guys haven't been following me for a long time, I think it was last year or the year before that, I did some nails inspired by a luggage at Ross as well. How do you save jewelry after using them? Like, how do you remove the glue? Well, I knew that my nails were not going to be forever nails, so I didn't put a lot of glue. Because I, I was thinking in advance. I was like, what can I do? that I can change quickly without having to remove my nails so that I can create more content. 
and designs, you know? So I didn't put too much glue on my on my cherries and I put it on top of top coat so that just made it easier to remove. Wait till we put on the cow print. It's gonna look so cute. So I have as my base, I have Luscious Pink. And then I'm using Gel Polish 21 to do the French. Damn it, I fucked it up up here. New. Hazily, hi, bit. So I'm. This is my first coat. I'm gonna put a second coat right now. So if it's a little streaky, it's okay. All right now, let me put this in the lamp really fast. Do you ever get a cramp? Yes, I do. I got one last time actually. I'm definitely an extendo type of girl. Me too. I like nail long nails, but I feel like these are just a little bit too long for me. I normally go like down here, like they're still fucking long, but that piece makes a difference. One French is more round than the other. Oh, yeah, I forgot to check that. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not OCD. Um, I'm not OCD about my French. I'm, most of the time I cover them. Can you say, hey, London, hey, what acrylic are you using? I use Luscious Pink from my website. The link is on my bio if you're interested in getting it. <sighs> you're so right. I didn't even fix this one. So normally I round it out more. But I guess I'm over here trying to be Speedy Gonzalez and shit that I didn't even try to fix the tip. So after I do that, I fill it in and then I fix it. Because Tato Chuecs también, no manches. Thank you for letting me know. But if they don't come out the same, it's okay. I don't really mind. I wait, I fucked it up. A ver, ha quedado poquito más round. Yeah, that, that, sh that should do, girl, because my eyes hurt. I don't have my stupid glasses on. Every time I want to do, like, nail art, I don't get my glasses. Did your family let you practice on them when you first started? Um, Yes and no at the same time. Just a heads up, I'm an observer. Okay, <laughs> thank you for being my observer. <clears throat> Is the bling adhesive a cluster gel mm, that everyone is recommending? Mm? Have you heard of broken nail? Yes, I, I've heard them a while back, but I haven't heard one recently. Thank the Lord. Do you live on certain days? No, they're normally random. They're random days. Normally I go to work on Wednesdays, Wednesdays and Saturdays to the salon. But I do work one Friday a month. So instead of Wednesday, I work on a Friday. And when that happens, I... I can go live longer. Um, do I like working on family? No. No, because my family is basic as shit. Well, yes and no, I guess. 
like my sister, she likes little nails. Well, she don't really wear nails, but when she lets me do them, they're little and basic. So it's like, eh, like what if? But I don't really have other family that gets their nails on with me besides one of my aunts. What are my aunts? I used to do more family before when I started, but um, not anymore. It's like, I don't know if they just don't want to pay me or some shit, or they think I'm expensive. I don't know. It could be both. Or they just don't live near me. La verdad, no shay. And I don't care because I don't want to do their nails either. I didn't want she missed a gift, girl. What gift? Sorry. Somebody sent me a gift? Is it because estoy concentrada aquí en mi, en mi French? Perdóname. Al Chile, they don't want to pay. Mood, they sent you a heart. Oh, thank you, whoever sent me a heart. Um, yeah, when I was a beginner, I wouldn't really charge my my cousins or family. Um, I did charge them something because obviously it's your job; you have to charge something. But they wanted like oh, fuck everything on their nails, and it's like, honey, I can't give you everything. It costs money, you know the shit they get with you you know so i was like eh, whatever i used to think it was fucked up but you know what if anything it's part of life people do that and i feel like they're the most picky anyway so why are you gonna be servicing them and then to once this she's not my family but she was like a family friend this fucking bitch left me hanging once I used to do nails outside of my mom's house when I just started because they didn't want me inside. And so I had set up my whole changarro and shit. I had set up my whole station outside, my little tables, the little light, everything, bitch. And I estaba como pendeja esperándola and she didn't have the audacity to tell me that she was not going to come. She just told me like, I'm on my way, I'm on my way. Y nunca llegó. Until I got fucking mad and I put my shit away. But dude, I ended up texting her. And I was like, hey, so where are you? And then she's like, oh, I'm not going to make it. I'm like, wow. I was like, fuck that bitch. So I was like, fuck that shit. Um, I, I use tips for the most part. I don't really sculpt. I, I know people say it's easy to fix fingers when they're crooked with forms, but I don't know, girl, I struggle to do my nails. Maybe next time I'll sculpt my nails. I occasionally sculpt them, but for the most part, I do, I do, oh, hi, Nancy. I do, um, nail tips. I just feel like it's faster. I'm already a slow ass bitch, so I don't need to like it anymore. Anyone in here from San Marcos? Hi, Stacy. Sorry, I just get here where you get your brush. Um, Jennifer, it's from my website. They are everything that I'm using right now is available on my website. The link is on the bio. Um, the black handles they come in a set of four, so you can find it there. I am a lefty. All right, so we have one more finger. Maybe I should be charging my other one. Hold on, guys. Let me put my lamp to charge. So my not polished lamp, it died on me. And I thought I was charging it, but it's not charging. So I'm just going to put some more there. And 
I just got my package today. Yes, honey. I'm so excited for these Moo Moo nail. Labaka Moo. Labaka Moo. Zule is gonna set those nails. Oh shit. We're about to start cow trending cow nails. Fuck that ombre reverse shit. We're about to switch this trend, alright guys? We all gonna have cow nails. After you guys see this cow, you're gonna all want it. We're gonna say goodbye. Goodbye to the summer with these cows. I want to connect, right? It wasn't connected or is it the lamp? Um, it wasn't connected. Well, the charger was connected, but I guess I didn't charge it long enough. Hmm, now it's stuck. I wonder if it charges what's off or has to be on. Hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ma'am, me la puse bien chueca, mami. La mamá de la mamá de la mamá de la mamá. Um, I'm using my own brushes. I have a whole brand, just in case you're new. Um, the brush that I am currently using is the liner brush 25mm. My pink liner brush. Alright, now let me paint it. Y si me salen chuecas, a mi me vale vergas, okay? Yo con que cargue uña is okay. It's okay, honey. Obviously, the goal is to make it as straight as possible, pero, pero. Aquí no me aguito. I'm new to TikTok. Okay, girl. Have my new little followers. Welcome. Welcome, new followers. Guess what I made for dinner? A hamburger. Don't tell me, don't tell me you made a hamburger girl or a hot dog. What you make? Welcome, hoes. Mm hmm. Welcome. Right here, we say bad words, okay? Left and right occasionally, but if you guys don't like bad words, please close away because uh, I be throwing F bombs all the time. I'm gonna be doing some cows, some beautiful, colorful cows. Hamburger with all the fixings. Ooh, yes, girl. First time I used to lay glue, I dropped it and it glued on my phone chargers together. <gasps> oh my god. Hey, well, at least they won't be going nowhere. Okay, there is my thumb oh shit so all my black brushes these they come in a set of four i'm using one of them which is the fat one to fill in the uh, the white and then to clean it i'm using the slimmer one they come in a set of four 
And then the set also comes with two liner brushes. Um, you can find them on my website under brushes, I believe, or tools for 35 cookies. How hard is it to, to start your own product line? Um, I don't want to call it hard. It's just time consuming and um, it takes a lot of research, trial and error, and then just a lot of hours. So it's not hard. It's doable, but you just have to put in a lot of time and then obviously to promote it and all that. It's a lot of work, but if you're a workaholic, you like to work hard or whatever, definitely recommend if it's something you want to do. What is a pink thing you speared on your table? Oh, that I spread? This napkin? I call it um a diaper. Yeah. People call it dental bibs or whatever you call it, whatever you like. I call them diapers, a.k.a. like disposable towels. I have them available on my website or you can find them on Amazon. Wherever you like, honey. My white gel polish always comes out lumpy. Um, I learned, actually, I think I'm just going to try to fill it in. I learned that you have to try to apply it like thin. Because I'm not a professional at polishing with gel, okay? So... Little by little, the more that I do it, um, I I learned that you're supposed to apply thinly, even if you have to do multiple coats, so that it, they don't come out like lumpy and thick. Because we try to be cheaters sometimes and add a lot to get the full coverage, you know? Trust me, I've done it before. I still do it sometimes. Pero como dicen, el, traba, el huevón trabaja doble. So don't be a huevona like Zuley. La mamada, la mamada, la mamada, la mamada, la mamada. The chameleon is everything. I'm going to try to put the chameleons in my next scoop. Or at least a few colors. Because I know y'all are going to love them. Y las cherries, ahí andan. I took them off. I clipped them off because I had another vision. Como dijo la Drea the other day, she had a vision. I'm just kidding. I didn't have a vision. I... I was looking at my pictures on my phone and I came across a cow I took a picture of last time. Well, I took a picture with the cow. Probably when you guys see the nails, you guys will remember this cow because I posted it on my Instagram before. Pero me la van a ver, me van a ver la cow. La cow, la moo. La moo moo moo. I need that brush. Yes, girl. Y'all all need this brush set. All of y'all bitches and hoes need these brushes. They are bomb.com. I, I feel like a true artist. Now that I have a brush set. You know, like that's just for nail art. I feel like an actual artist. Because I get to use them now. Like I've been doing. I've been doing like art. Like 3D art. But not like painting. So I'm definitely trying to get into it a little bit more. Because it's my weakness. So I know I keep telling you guys this all the time lately. But practice your weaknesses. You shall have no weakness, bitch. No weakness.
I have been doing nails for about 10 years now. Like legit that I wanted to like ever since I kind of was in my nail journey. Um, but I want to say I started doing it as a hobby, like painting my nails and things like that. Not really doing acrylics for like 12 years. Well, since I was little, I kind of like painting toes and doing all that bullshit. But I really realized I liked it like 10 years ago. So early this month, or no, 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 I'm lying. It's been eight years already that I've done it full time. So it took me like fucking almost two years, no, two years to get my license. Because a bitch would only go on Saturdays. These are my dream nails. I thought any las bands. We're not done with the design yet. Wait until we're done with the little cow prints. You guys are all gonna... We're all gonna be twinsies, okay? I dare you all to recreate these nails when I'm done. Maybe you don't have to put the whole cow that I am gonna be putting on, but everything else. We all need to change the trend. I hate it. I hate the ombre. I hate it. Okay, so let me cook these. Hold on. Wow, Zule, you did a good job, girl. <laughs> Gotta give myself a little pat in the back. Bet I'm gonna do it tomorrow, maybe Friday on my day off. Agreed. What's the one design you hate doing the most? Mm, French. <laughs> I hate it. So let me tell you guys why I hate it. Or I hated it before. Because I suck at it. So normally you hate doing things you're not good at. But once you practice them and you get better, you like them. Sorry guys, I'm drinking water. So I hate doing Frenches for the most part, but it's like a love and a hate. Do you do lovely Mimi's nails? Yes, ma'am. Teach me. Okay. Ombre is my enemy. What? Girl, ombre is so easy. I used to hate ombre too, though. I feel you. I'm from California. Would you consider going mobile on a converted truck? Actually, that was my business plan when I was in college. My teacher was like, wow, that's an amazing idea. But because I used to live in the hood, I was like, bitch, where am I going to store this fucking truck without it getting jacked or tagged in? So I never really pursued that. But that's an amazing idea if you guys want to do that. I personally will not travel for nobody. I don't give a fuck who you are. I ain't going to you. You better come to me because I ain't, I would so forget my shit. <laughs> um, Why does my bling adhesive turn white after I clean the top of with alcohol? Oh, because it's not dry yet. If the glue is not fully dry and you wet it, it's going to turn white. So make sure you spray glue activator to freeze it in place. And then after a few seconds, you can wipe it. Wouldn't you have to be licensed in each state or no? Well, she doesn't mean like traveling state to state. She just means like traveling house to house. Which I don't even know if that's legal, to be honest, because, um, but I mean, who am I to tell you? I mean, you do whatever you want, girl, but just thinking now that we're in that topic, um, when you have a license, when you have your business license, we're supposed to give them our address, you know, and we can only pretty much do nails at that address. So if... And when I'm put one more coat just to make it a little bit more even. Um, 
So if and when the state board comes to hunt us down or whatever to check up on us, that's the address they show up to. But I mean, ¿cómo te van a cachar? How would they knew? How would they knew? Unless your little license is a travel in your truck. I don't fucking know, girl, actually. And there's no. Um, the pink on my nails is luscious pink. So I'm just going over it a little bit just to make sure that it's it's all even or semi even. Have you thought about getting your product in local nail supply stores? Um, I have thought about that. Um, but I feel like my brand is not that big yet. Like I don't have that much quantity is what I mean. Like I I don't have enough product. I would have to buy more to expand. But definitely um, an idea I would like to have, you know, because especially like in another country. Because shipping is not the easiest. Like I've had a few stores reach out to me, like small businesses that they would like to carry my products. But I don't really have that many, you know. To share share with damn wish i could do my own nails girl you could do them good you just have to practice i've been doing my nails for 10 years now my own painting them or whatever what gel is this this is gel number 21 from my my tiendita just in case you're like what brand Zule brand, ma'am. So I'm literally just going over like towards the tip. I only outlined it once and I'm just going in through the rest of the nail with the gel here and there to kind of make them like white, 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 white. Okay, ma'am, we're done with this part. Now let's cook them. Now time for the fun part. How did you start your own brand? Oh shit, I touched the nail. Um, I started as a hobby. Well, I had an idea since I started doing nails. Like since I was going to school for it, I kind of wanted to be a teacher. And then I wanted to, I was like, oh my God, imagine I had a, like products or things with my name. Like not necessarily like nail products, but just in general things with my name so it, i thought about it as an idea then i started my online store and started selling favorites of mine like nail favorites and little by little i started to invest in different products so i don't remember exactly what were the first few products but for sure it was the glue um the files my brushes but you have to research the items that you want. Um, try them out. Make sure you love them and all of that. And then start investing and slowly grow it. Um, but one thing that I am going to share that I wish I would have known. So this is why I'm sharing it. Is get your paperwork and all of that um, in order before you start. If you know it's going to be something long term. Like... It's not a hobby because I started my store like as a hobby for fun. I didn't really think it would grow to what it is now. Like, you know, the lay nails and shit. I just started selling for fun. And to get rid of some of my extra things that I would buy. Um, And then later on, the accounting and all of that kind of came and bit me in the butt. Um, and stress me the fuck out. So get a business license. Try to Google as much information as you can as far as opening a small business. 
every state varies so you're researching your state before you do anything okay because back then when i started online businesses were not as popular so now i think it's a little bit more um like the irs and shit is more on top of you you know the IRS and the whatever the fuck. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start making black spots on all my nails. All right, let me. I'm going to put my finger here. I'm going to make cows. So literally just like whatever, okay? Some bigger than the other because no cow is the same. The glue turned like jelly, like texture, and none of us could use it. Um, how long did you have it for, girlfriend? Normally, that happens when your glue is either contaminated or old. So I'm gonna put a few spots first, like random shit. And then and I just bought it. Oh, okay. Are are we talking about the gel? If if you're talking about the glue, I mean, shake it. Shake the glue good good because when it's hot it gets thicker. But if it's like hard and you cannot open it, then you need a new one. Okay, Jenny, make sure to shake it really good. Like mix it with the brush because when it's hot, when it goes from hot and cold or whatever, just sits in the heat, like in the mailman's car, it will get thicker. But as you continue to use it and mix it, it goes back to normal. Because this girl, she was like, Zule, my glue got, got really thick and stringy or whatever. And then she sends me a video, right? And she could not even open it. It was stuck. And I was like, well, let me check when she bought this glue, right? It had already been a year. I was like, ma'am, ma'am, a year? And she's like, oh, I didn't, I don't know. I don't know if it lasts that long. Like, girl. Glue doesn't last that long. She's like, okay, let me buy another one. I was like, okay. So I'm going to make this spot bigger. Ooh. Yeah, just like weird. Make them weird looking. The weirder, the better. What causes a gel not to dry? Could it be the lamp? It could be the lamp. It could be um, that you applied it too thick. It could be that the finger was not positioned properly in the lamp. So typically, the fingers that don't get a lot of light are the thumbs. So if it's a thumb we're talking about, it's most likely the position of the hand was not um, correct. Like they were not facing up. They were sideways. But the lamp does play a big role in your dry time. So if it's not strong enough, like if you have a really, a really small lamp, then that definitely could be a, the reason. So make sure you have at least a nice size lamp that's at least 36 watts. If you are a nail professional like you already see clients you should have a good lamp don't be a coda ass that's something that um we need to how to call it remember that this is our business nails is our income you need to invest in your equipment at least your lamp and your electric file should and your chair should be one of the most expensive things that you own in your business, okay? Everything else vale pura verga. Like you can um get you don't need the best shit of other things, 
But that. Don't go for the cheap shit because it's going to last you a long time. It's an investment. So let me make my spots a little bigger. Because they're starting to look like clouds. So don't think about it. Just do the stupid spots like however. The less you think, the better. So let me just take a look at these. Make sure they don't look like freaking clouds. Because most likely they do. If they do look like clouds, make them look like a long cloud or some shit. Um, goo lagoon. Okay, so this is what they're looking like right now. Don't worry, we're about to hype them up a little bit. We're about to make them extra cute. What chair? What chair? You really? What chair you recommend? Oh, um, I currently have one from Amazon. It's a pink chair. I think it costs like seventy cookies or something like that. It's not too expensive. It does the job for a part-time job, but. Um, if you do nails full time, like five days a week, then you'd probably need an, a better one. So I'm going to be using these colors. They're all from my website. I'll give you guys the numbers as I open them. I'm going to use six, six galas. good lamp recommendation so kiara sky's lamp is good the manny pro lamp is good um i recently got the the what's it called the not polished one um so far so good i've only tried it a few times so give me some like a month or two so i could have a better review How long your before prep products last? Um, like your primers? It depends. Because if you use them often, you are constantly contaminating them if you're not cleaning the nail properly. And what I mean by contaminating is like you throw little dust particles in there. Things like that. So if you do nails on the regular, I recommend to change them every month or two. So this is number 93, the green one. I personally like to change my anything liquid like primers glue things like that at least every mm, two months depending on how much i work before when i used to do a full time like five days a week i used to change them every month only because i felt like they need to be working 100 percent. these bitches nails ain't better they better not be coming off you know like i ain't trying to risk it but that's just me like, I'm not going to wait for it to run out because most likely it's going to take forever. But once I saw one of the bottles and um, it was like the, the, ¿cómo se llama? The nail dehydrator was so foggy because <laughs> all the little dust particles and stuff. So then I was like, damn, imagine what the primers look like because we can see through those bottles. So that's when I realized, like, okay, girl. Oh, shit. Because I had a client who'd be like, oh, I don't know. This time my nails didn't last or whatever. Okay. Oh, shit. I didn't even tell you guys the color numbers, huh? Sorry, I forgot. That went all cheese, man. So this one is number 97. Number 61, which is the yellow one. Number 96, which is the purples. They should all be in the gel polish category, number 93, number 91, and number 94. So pretty much all the 90s, are they were my neon collection last year. Now let's get started. All right, let's start with the thumb. So I'm just going to go ahead and add random little dots to my nail. I'm going to try to... Um, Keep my finger on here. 
so I don't move too much. So, oh shit, I started with green, so I'm gonna do green first. Oh, wait, 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 not that. So I'm using my dotting tool. It comes with two sides, the small one and the big one. I'm gonna go in with the small side. What am I thinking? And I'm literally just doing a dot, okay? So I guess I'll do all of them green in different locations. That way I can move faster. And I'm not very good at nail art, so you guys are going to see that this is such an easy design. If I could do it, y'all can do it too. I'm going to go on with the next color. The colors. Oh, shit. I just touched something. Literally, like, in between the spots is where I'm putting the colors. Trying to alternate. positions you're so fun to listen to oh thank you okay now we're gonna do some purple i'm gonna put it here at the tip it's getting hot in here it's getting hot in here I'm gonna put this one over here and then later on if we need more spots I'll add more spots is it hers what was wrong with me my internet I love it already yes girl wait wait till you see what I got in store for you guys a pretty little cow. They look like little skittles on the nail, huh? Right now, we're going to do some blue. Some blue color. Some blue. No, you're loading perfectly line perfectly oh perfectly fine if for whatever reason i am lagging to you close your app close your app and restart it and then i need pink all right so i'm gonna do pink here i'll do the pink here and then i'll do the pink here Loki, I'm starting to see zebra up in here, not fucking cows anymore. But it's okay, honey. It's okay. It's okay. After when I'm done, if I feel like it needs more cow, I'll go ahead and add. So I'm going to put this in the lamp to cure my little dots. It's giving 90s vibes. What do you think the dots are going to be? <clears throat> Hello. Only because you're overly looking. What happened? Did you see something crooked? I feel like I need a cheek lit. Why do I feel like you say that? Because of the bubble gum. Hmm? What is a good desk lamp to use? Not the UV light, but the desk lamp. Um, I forgot what the stupid brand is called. But I posted it on my Instagram once. I don't remember if it was on a story or what. Um, but I got it on Amazon, that lamp. Some One of my fellow nail techs recommended it to me. Where's the music? I do not put music because... Oh, shit. Because I post these videos on my YouTube channel and, you know, we ain't trying to get copyright righted or anything like that. Okay. So now I'm just going to go in with random colors. So let's see. I'll start with, 
I'm gonna do my fat side of the of the dotting tool and I'm gonna start making like little petals, like little just dots, like one dot, two dot, like if they're little flowers. Literally so easy. That flower came out a little fug fugly, but it's okay. And then I'm gonna repeat it on different colors. The more you do it, the easier it gets, okay? I promise. So pay attention because everybody's going to have these nails, all right? We all going to be wearing cow, cow nails. So I'm going to stick with the pink and just alternate the colors, the center. So the center shall all never match the color of the outline. Um, I don't know if I did it on blue yet, but and it doesn't have to be perfect. I'm gonna cure this real quick so that the flower petals don't move around or anything like that. Reminds me of Toy Story. I'm gonna show you guys a picture. Look at. This is where I got the inspo from. Where the fuck is the picture? Look, I took a picture with this cow in a restaurant. <laughs> and that's where I got the idea from. The little flowers and the little cow. I was like, if I was a cow, this would be me. So that be me, honey. Yeah, so I would be that cow. All right, next. Next color. I'm going to do green. Eventually, yes. I finished my homework. Good job. Is Patrick done with his homework? No. So I'm going to do green over here. I'm sorry if my nails getting in the way, but they're fucking huge. Um, I'm using my gel polishes from my store. You can find them. The link is on the bio. They're super pigmented and beautiful. Was that your son? No, that's my husband. He had homework from our CPA. So he's the one that does all my business related things like my accounting, my anything with that shit he is in charge of. So that's why I say um it's it's a little it was a little stressful before he started helping me. And then here I'm just gonna do a little baby. Pleasant, come out with your own press-on nail glue. Um. Oh, please. I actually have a nail glue already, girl. You could use that. The nail glue, the little tubes, you could use it for nail press-ons. So it won't touch. What happened, Daisy? What you say? So it won't touch. You usually cook for 60 seconds or does it depend? Um, I try to keep it for at least 90 seconds, but sometimes I just do 60. Do you have pre-shaped full cover nail tips? Yes, we do. They should be in the nail tip category. I have coffin, stiletto, and square. Me encanta tu acento. Ay, gracias. Nailed by Rios. Do you only five dots around the middle? Oh, no, I do five or six. Lo que quepa, amiga. Look it. So right here, I did six. Right here, I did three. Right here, I did five. 
right there i did that one i don't know what happened to that one but bitch i'm not a perfectionist those little petals as long as from far away they look like a flower it's all good in the neighborhood obviously when you're not on the camera you could do them a little bit better but i feel pressure here i nah, just kidding let me try to do a nicer one let me close up Like, if you do the petal smaller, you can, they won't touch, but I like, I like my big dotting tool. Um, no, we do not ship international, sorry. International shipping is a pain in the butt. So you could do five petals if you want and do six petals. Lo que tú quieras, amigas. Whatever you like, honey. You could even do two without a fucking center. Just the point is to get creative. Um, I think I'm going to do it on the orange. Raise your hand if you're going to try this tomorrow. Lo que quepa, ajá, huh? lo que quepa. Porque obvio que las uñas chiquitas no les van a caber tantos pétalos. So that's why I was like, this is a perfect length. Perfect length for these, um, um, what is it called? Cows. So I guess if you wear shorter nails, try to do like two spots so you can fill more flowers or whatever. One flower on each nail. Different. How did you remove your old set without filing too much of your acrylic? Um, I just used my coarse bit. ¿Cuánto cobras por eso? Ay, amiga, pues no sé. Es la primera vez que lo voy haciendo, pero pues... Doble del French porque es trabajo. Zule, are your nails? Wait, are Zule, are the nails you're wearing tapered square? Um, they're just the normal square shape ones. Quisiera, pero no me va a salir ham hermosas, tan hermosas. Claro que les va a ser, salir bonitas, no sean tan negativas, ándale. 100 por flor. No, hombre, estas flores son rápidas, no tan caras. This design, I would totally do on a client because, like you see, it's effortless, not super perfect, but it's okay. All right, what color are we missing? Purple. Like, I wouldn't mind doing this on a client. Unless she's fucking picky and she's like, that petal is not as round as that other one. Uh-uh, I'm gonna throw her away. Like, ma'am, of course it's not. All cows are different. Even their flower petals. Even the petals. Si sí, se puede. Si sí, se puede. We're taking it back to the chinita flowers, okay? With the toothpicks. I'll do this one right here. Look, the more you do, the easier it gets. See, I'm becoming a professional already. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh my god, I had one of those picky clients today. It was such a headache. Unfortunately, they exist, but we gotta deal with them too. Nomás cobrale, me, eh, cobrale extra. Por eso, pero si el French toma tiempo. <laughs> Anything you recommend for back pain? Mm, try to get yourself a better chair if you don't already have a good chair try most nail techs that i've seen have a wide desk 
so try to get a slimmer one almost where you guys are like hitting each other's knees now you're about to play footsies because that's what causes back pain when your client leans back like a chola and you have to fucking bend forward or like even if they don't lean back you still have to bend forward to do their nails so try to just get a desk where you don't have to bend forward as much because trust me i never paid attention to that and now all my desks are slim even if they lean like cholas i still fucking I still reach them. And then don't be afraid to tell them, I'm going to put your hand a little bit, okay? Like, I'm going to put your hand a little bit. Especially if you need to reposition them. So these are my gel polishes. No hable tanto, Dios mío. Ay, si no te gusta... Pues vete, aquí yo hablo lo que se me dé la gana, ¿ok? O aún bájale el volumen, bájale el volumen si no te, si no quieres escucharme. Oh wait, I really did pink. So ¿cuál me falta? I did green, I did yellow, I need blue. Blue and orange. La sacaron ya. Ok, gracias. Esta señora que no hable, the fuck. Ni que estuviera en la pinche clase para que me digan que me calle. Se me hace que era la maestra de español que tenía yo. When I was in high school, my Spanish teacher fucking hated me because I talked so much. She'd kick me out or put me against the corner, the wall. Make by myself in my little desk. And she'll always give me an F. Wait, what happened? Oh, this fucking lady came to tell me to stop talking so much. Like the fuck? Si a mi mamá no le hago caso. ¿Por qué le voy a venir a hacer caso a usted? Like, por favor, señor. Vaya a ver qué puso la pinche marrana ahí en su casa. Like, por favor, vaya a educar sus hijos. And, y eso que I'm not even saying nothing like bad, you know? Like, imagine I was talking about perverted and shit. Ya me hubieran bloqueado, no mames. Qué bueno que a ver si me estoy compartiendo. She having PTSD. <laughs> Real. So these are my little nails so far. Then they complain when you don't talk. Like, pon la música mejor. No te quiero escuchar. Hablas demasiado. Did she pay for this class? And no, she didn't. She sure didn't. I need a floss stick, guys. Her opinion don't matter. Mm -hmm. Switching from a rolling chair to a non-rolling chair for clients made a huge difference. I've always wanted to do that, but I haven't. Only because if they sit down when the chair's far away, I se quedan. Like, ma'am, come closer. Don't bite. Are you doing food tonight? Um, I'm going to make a cow. So does the cow as food? All right, the next color I'm going to do is orange. So let me do my little orange flower. Pay me and I'll be quiet. Aunque, aunque me paguen, yo no me callo. Me, de, me desmayo sin hablar. Ever since somebody mentioned five petals, it's like, that's all I be doing now. Five petals. Like, that's what you want to see? That's what I'm going to give you, my friend. Five petals. It 
Is Portia in here? Portia girl, you in here? I don't think I've seen her yet. La yo siempre hablando el witty 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 witty. Are you having a sale for Labor Day? Um, I normally don't have sales because my store is already at a great price. But I'll probably pick one item and have a sale. Just for you. Five petals draws six. Hey, girlfriend. How many did you put before? Six. Six. I'm like, my sale is going to be one item only. <laughs> yeah, the scoops are the sale. So I'm going to try to have maybe once a month for a little bit scoop. So that's technically the sale. You're right. You are right. So if I have a Labor Day sale, I can't have a scoop party. I need the buchana, buchona vibe. It's beautiful, huh? I always miss the freaking scoops. Ooh, pues, put, turn on your notifications, girl, so you don't miss out. All right, so let's check out these nails. Let me see, do I need a flower somewhere else? So I'm gonna add some little petals here. I wait. I'm going to pretend like that was a flower, but the center fell off. You know? Hi, Patrick. Hello. You're done? Mm -hmm. Okay, my debit card's right there. Here I go. I'll make everyone in your... My life? Yeah, they're all jealous that their kids... Mm -hmm. Don't hand over a hundred. Oh, Patrick's about to spend a hundred cookies. No, wow. I gave it to my mother and it's strange of Life? her credit card. Oh, damn. <laughs> okay, Patrick's about to spend all his dough on cards. Patrick is the little panda on the other side. Oh. Uh, hey, I Kaiser Permanente. Mm -hmm. This message is brought to you by AT&T. <laughs> <laughs> he is going to buy Yu-Gi-Oh cards with um okay. his money, his hard-earned money and oh sleeves. God. A few months ago. <laughs> I'm going to put a cow on that one. Um, If you can't find the desk lamp, I'll take a picture of it on Friday when I go. Or I'll look at my story archive and then I'll post it up again. So I'm going to go in and fix some of my cow print. Hold on, guys. My nails are drying. I haven't made the cow yet. <laughs> I have to make it. Okay, let's see. So I'm going to extend some of these cows. Oh fuck, I got green by accident. I'm going to make a, a little cow, a baby cow right now. And then right here on the sides of the Frenchies, I'm going to add more little spots. Oh, my thing is lagging. Okay, unplug, unplug Patrick. I love how they're looking. Aren't they so cute? 
All right, so I think I'm pretty happy with my cows. Yeah, whatever. All right, now let's fully cure this so we can top coat and start making our cow, our little ring finger cow. Can't wait, so I can tell my husband I made him. You, what do you mean? The cow? Zule, we have another friend here named Portia. Dile hello. Hi, Portia, number two. I've never seen that design before. It's so cute. We copied it from a cow, like an actual cow in this restaurant called Mama Por Dios. I like it, Picasso. Oh, Portia, 7777. Seven, seven, seven. Seven. I wish I can do both hands looking flawless because my left hand has a mind of its own. Girl, you got to train it. My right hand has a mind of its own. So right now, after they're fully cured, now I'm leaving them in there for 90 seconds so the colors can dry good, good, good. I'm going to top coat them because I don't want no lint to get stuck or anything like that. And I'm going to be using my Zule top coat. You should go to the restaurant to take a picture with the nails with the cow as a background. <laughs> I did take a picture, so check it out. So look at, oh fuck. Where the fuck did it go? So these were the nails I had when I took a picture with the cow. These colorful ones. And then I took a picture with the cow. Alrighty, now let's put the top coat. What kind of brush is that, Zule? Um, which one are you talking about? Oh, the restaurant is called Mama Por Dios. Mama. Yep, there's inspo everywhere. We just have to start seeing it like that. Yeah, I'm going to put some bling. I'm just going to seal it in first. Yeah, casi se me acaba mi gel. I need a new one. I'm going to put very little bling, though, because my full, my, how to call it, my full attention, I want it to be on my cow print. Another thing, like, if you guys don't know how to draw or whatever, like, I'm such a professional at drawing. i eh, just kidding. Um, It would look cute with a little 3D flower somewhere. Let me just... Patrick, can you bring me a, a, a new top coat? Yeah, the shiny one, please. I'm running low. I, I haven't made the cow yet. I'm going to make it right now. But first, got to secure the decorations, the nail art. Um, I have a 3XL length. I'm using my 3XL square tips. Here are my other hand. Is it stain resistant? Um, no. Yes and no. So I have a customer who has purple hair. Um, she has purple hair, so her nails got stained a little bit, but it comes off once you wash your hands after a while. So, like, yeah, they'll get stained, but not forever. Just wipe it with a little alcohol. Good night, Delay. Can't wait to see the finished look. Good night, Nancy. Get one for me, too. I te mando esta San Juan. Ya no tiene. 
I'm outside in my car lane in the back with the AC watching your live. Okay, girl. Get it, get it, get it. What? No, this one. The white one. Racist. <laughs> oh, wait. I have one right here in my... In my my table. Yeah. Well, I'm going to leave it right here. Thank you, Patrick. Thank you. I'm going to like, put it back on there. All right. Let me... Polish, polish, polish. So, I dare everybody to go try these, okay? We're all going to be twinsies. I mean, my cow, this one does not look like a fucking cow. That one looks like a splat of paint. How hot was it in your city, Zule? It was 104 today. Tomorrow is going to be 106. Let's see. Alexa, what's the weather like right now? Fuck. It's 91 degrees right now. It's 91 degrees right now, Lord. I, I'm going to put top coat on this one too, only because I don't want my... Hell no, it's 90 in Long Beach. I couldn't handle it. It would look so good in matte. I wanted to try it in matte too, actually, but no... White nails don't go good with matte. They will get dirty. For sure. Especially with my lifestyle. Mm -mm. Our dogs are inside. Well, my dog. Lenny stay inside all the time. I wanna be a colada. These nails are about to be one of my favorites. My other set, I I clipped it off. I just kidding. I only removed the decoration. Lenny's IG is Lenny the Bitch Poo. Um, no, the ring finger, I'm going to put a cow on it, but I have to make it first. So that's why it looks plain right now, but we're about to decorate it in a second. I just want to secure all my nails. Make sure that I don't fuck them up or stain the nail or anything like that because, um, this gel polish does not cure it cures tacky, so if if I touch anything with it, it will get stuck. And ain't nobody trying to ruin my nails. Did I just fucking touch something? So that looks so cute. All right, go in the lab. Now we're going to do a cow. Do you only top coat your nails once? What do you recommend? Yes, I only top coat my nails once. You do not need to top coat twice. Back in the day, you did, but not no more. So I'm going to move my palette just in case I need it again. I don't know. Does a top coat dry tacky? No, it doesn't. It's a no wipe. Um, I'm liking the the lamp so far. No complaints. So, I think I'm going to make my cow with the udders are normally pink, huh? With this color. 
Is that shape different from the other hand? No, they're the same. Just that I could shape the other hand better. So these are like super square. The other ones are still square, but um, hold on, I'll show you right now. I didn't get to see the burger finish like night last night. Oh, look, it's right here. So yesterday we made a boba out of um the sculpting gel. We made a little boba with a wannabe umbrella. Check it out. Hasta le pusimos un pepinito a la pinche boba maldita. The cup is actually made out of gel too. We made the chilito right here. The chile, we made a whole ice cream and a whole hamburger. Check it out with all them ingredients, handmade. No preservatives, I promise. We may have meat, cheese, bacon, tomato, onion, lettuce, and sesame seeds. And then we made an ice cream. Look at that cone, though. Mm, even the cherry. Look at it. Wow. So we made all of that yesterday with the 3D sculpting gel. We were cooking. So my fingers were a little bit brown from all that gel that I had, like rolling it and shit. Um, so now I'm going to make a cow. The lime on the boba is so cute. Thank you. That's like the one thing I did not make. The lime. Is my lamp not charging? What the fuck is wrong with it? Weird. My not polished lamp is not charging. Okay, so first I'm going to start with the body of the cow. So it's going to be white. Let me get my little paper here. All right, where is my... I was using a little spatula. Hmm. Oh, my little spatulita is not clean. Hold on, guys. Let me find another. Hmm. I'm going to use my cuticle pusher. Okay, so I'm going to get some with my cuticle pusher. I'm not sure how big I'm going to make this cow. I don't normally have a specific time. Patrick! Go take a shower. So when you come out, we can watch TV. All right, so I'm going to get a little bit of alcohol so I can start pressing down my 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 cow. Is there fucking hair in it? So I guess this is going to be the little body. The little body of the little cow. Wait, does that fit in my nail? Maybe I should make it slimmer. This is the body of the cow, guys. Not the head. This is where the udders are going. Let me measure. Fuck it if it sticks out, huh? 
Fuck it. That's our main attraction. Ándale, vaquita. Tienes que estar un poco flaca porque no vas a caber en la neo. Alright, so we're making a little cow. Okay, now I did the body of it. Ow. That's like the stomach. Donde sale el menudo. Let me put this in the lamp really quick. <sighs> Let me see um, my picture that I have. Or maybe that could be the whole body. Move. Oh shit. El menudo. El menudo. All righty. Let me flip it around. So if you guys use sculpting gel, yeah, you need um, you need um, what is it called? You need to flip it around. The little mouth is it brown? What color is it? Hold on, I forgot to check. Menudo pasale. Hmm, I think it it doesn't have a face. So I guess I'll do it pink, just like the belly. Oh shit. Where did my TikTok go? Okay. cute all right so next i'm going to sculpt the little mouth i guess i'll do it brownish pinkish tan huh let me get a little bit of the tan and a little bit of the pink more money patrick I was sending to go shower, so yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. so we can watch TV when you're done. If you come out on time. A tip. Oh yes, I got a tip. It's not a tip. It's free. Yeah, it's free. For some reason, yeah, eight dollars more expensive. Oh damn! Oh, my little ball fell. Let me get a let me get it again. It fell. Chinga madre. Gotta start over. This is why you use an apron, guys, when you cook because se te caña la mierda. So I don't really sculpt them on the nails. I sculpt it first and then I put it onto the nail so that it dries good. Because gel, you need to cure really good. Otherwise, it won't dry. All right, so this is going to be the little mouth. Let's see how this works. I guess this is just going to be the body and the whole shebang. ¿Cómo va la pinche nariz? La boca? Yo 
Not sure it was under cure though. Algo así va la pinche boquita. No. Mm. Hold on, let me look at my picture. Oh, it's like a little oval. I used to play like a little farm game before. Like so cute, it's gonna be so cute. So I guess I ended up making it kind of like pinkish brown. Cause the udder is gonna be like that. Maybe I should make it smaller. It looks like a fucking huevo right now, but trust the process guys. Trust the process. I should have probably not put it on here, but fuck it, fuck it. This is a temporary cow. We're gonna make it a little nostril. Should we put a piercing on it? <laughs> oh, fucking piercing on my cow, bitch. All right, let me put my little cow to cure. Meanwhile, I'm gonna start in the boob area. My udder. Oh, cow. The udder, I think I'm gonna do it um pink. Pa que tenga lechita de strawberry. All I hear is Doja Cat, bitch, I'm a cow, over and over in my head. <laughs> bitch, I'm a cow. All right, so meanwhile, my, my thing here is I'm going to start working on the udder. It even has a flitter. What the hell, you little glitter? Get out of here. We don't want a mole. Where's the inspo for the cow set? Um, literally a cow. Hold on, I'll show you right now. So this is the cow. My friend, cow. Oh, damn. Cow, come back. Oh, my God. Se me cayó la perra. Ven pa' acá, cambaquita. Parece pinche chancla la cow ahorita. I hope it comes out cute. Okay, fuck it. I guess I'll put that. I'll leave that little, that little fucking glitter in there. Porque no se quiere caer. It's like an infection already in there. I think that's a cute little thing. Ahorita le hago las tetas a la perra. Le voy a hacer cuatro chichitas. My cat goes moo, moo. An infection, yeah, she got a little infection going on. Oh 
Oh, fuck. I keep going back to my picture and I forget to put TikTok back. All right, let me flip it over. It's all about patience with these gels. Gotta flip it like a tortilla. Oh my God, you know what would be so cute? A little piglet. Okay, flip it around because it's okay. También. Oh shit. So these are my nails. We're gonna put the little cow on this finger. This is about to be the cutest vaca. It's going to be a baby. La vaca. Moo. La vaca. Moo. Did you do these nails on live today? Yes, we did them right now. All right, let's glue the udder on. Let me get my glue. I'm going to put it with the labeling adhesive. Oh, shit, that's too much. That's too much glue, Zule. Ahorita le pongo las chichitas. All right, now let me get the little boobies. The little boobies and the little baby cow. And then... A ver, hold on, Bakita. Oh, 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 Right now, it's not looking like a cow. Trust the process, okay? Trust the process. All right, well, I guess I won't hold you. I'll just put you down. Oh! <laughs> that looks so fucking cute. A little udder, honey. Honey. Wait till I show you guys sideways. That stuff you're using to make the cow face? What is the stuff? Um, it's my 3D sculpting gel. Ahorita les enseño up close and personal las chichitas. She a little shy. It's kind of like played over for nails. Can you guys see them from down there? One more, one more little udder. This is about to be the cutest thing I ever made. Y luego lo vamos a matar a hacer tacos de lengua. Zulay played with Play Doh and it shows. <laughs> I played with fucking mud. Play-doh, doh, doh, doh. That Loki looks like a little mesita on her stomach. Look, let me show it to you guys closer. Look at the little boobs. Como que tan grandecitas, ¿verdad? It's like a little round table. Ooh, 
We don't need no class when we have you. Mm-hmm. I played with masa when my mom wouldn't make when my mom would make tortillas. Jesus Alejandro. <laughs> Alejandro, Alejandro. Ale Alejandro. Oh fuck, oh fuck. We may stop dropping shit with your big nail. With your big cow nails. I thought it was cow udders. It is. She ain't shy. She has udder. She just had a baby because she was throwing it back. <laughs> it's supposed to be a baby. It's supposed to be a baby cow. Okay, now let's draw some little eyes on it. I'm going to use gel polish. Maybe I should add more. Hey, Zule, hi. Let me zoom you guys into my cow. My baby cow. I'm a baby, baby dog. It's a baby, baby, baby cow. All right, let me see. Wait. How should I draw the eyes? Like, just round? Oh, okay. Hold on, guys. Trying to draw a fucking cow eye. A ver como vas, vaquita. Oh, one eye is bigger than the other. Oh, no good. No good. Okay, baby cow, go in the lamp for one second, please. Do them round with a dotting tool. I work at the hospital. I would love some long nails. Girl, you could wear press-ons. Una tortilla hecha mano con sal. You stay changing your nails. Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. Um, hold on. I wait, Casey. All right, I'm gonna make the cow little arms. You're going to post a pic on your IG of desk lamp? Yes. If I remember, I'll post it. Send me a message on there so I won't forget. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. All right. My little baby is coming to life. So here's my little cow. Let's give it a little arm. Bitch, where are you going? Stay right here. Le hacemos orejas también. Cows have ears, huh? Yes, I saw everything that I'm using right now. This is a dotting tool with double end, a short one and a t longer one. Come on, cow. We're ready to put you on the nail almost. Be a good girl. By the way. It's too small.
It's because I never seen a cow like up close. Well, actually, right here where I live, there's cows, but they're kind of far. That's going to be the little arms. It's like a little baby one. Ahorita le ponemos las orejitas. que start looking like cow y le pintamos la mancha. I should probably just do little feet too while I'm at it. It's so cute. Yeah, they do have ears, huh? <laughs> I'm fucking dumb. Oh, sí, la boca, la boca. Mu, la boca, mu. Hold on, I put my cow here. So it could stand out. It's not looking like a cow just yet because it doesn't have its spots, but give it a second. It's coming to life. All right, we're going to give it some little patitas too. It looks cute at the bocas. That's true, huh? Because I always be fucking shit up when I put a face on it. Come on, you bitch. You should put some little horns on it. Okay. But don't the guys have the horns? The girls don't have horns, do they? I don't fucking know about cows, guys. I just want off a little one on my nail. Oh, so cute. It's a little baby. Next, we're going to do like a duck. That's so adorable. Wait, <laughs> it doesn't look like a cow yet. Trust the pros. Parece un pinche pingüino a la verga esto. Too much shit to know. That's so cute. No, cows have horns too. Okay, okay, okay. Let me get my phone closer so I can... So I can... How to, oh yeah, this cow does have horns, but doesn't have any ears. Or maybe I couldn't see the ears. Okay, I'm gonna make some baby, baby horn. But let me put the ears first. The baby ones have little nub horns. Ah, so cute. Okay. Oh, it's too late. A tu boca pon, a tu vaca ponle florecitas. I'll probably do it around it. Like I'll put the little cow and then I'll put flowers. <gasps> what if I do them 3D? Um, I'm supposed to do the ears. Okay, I'm going to do little ears. Come on, you little cow stay. I'm like, hold on, let me hold it down. No mames. <gasps> Le arranqué la pata. Oh my God. Hold on, let me glue the leg back. Let 
a cowbell. I'm not sure if all that gonna fit. The udders just took over. They took over everything. A three-legged cow. It's a girl cow. Okay, let me get the little horns. I mean, the little ears. I'm going to do it right here. Where did my brush go? Ponle la flor de moño. Oh my God, girl, did you make that? Yes, we're making it right now. We're attempting to make a baby cow here. Pero pues, estamos batallando poquito. I'm gonna make the, the ear over here. It could be like an ear horn. Half us. Mm, maybe this much. This definitely gets a little messy. Um. I'm over here so into my fucking little cow ears. Fuck it. I love one with it así. Metanse. I'm so invested. Me too. That's why I'm not talking. You should paint little pink triangles in the ears. Um, I should probably do them brown, no? Because their the mouth is brown. I said I hate. Huh? Get get it, Lenny. I'm making a cow. This is like a Samari you going to post final pick. Of course I am. So this is what the process looks like. I'm gonna post it on both. All my work I posted on both. Okay, time to glue them on. I think I'm gonna make them stick out. Kind of like the udders. Dude, did this shit get stuck to the pellet? Uh oh. I forgot. That it dries on whatever it's on. Ah, great. Have to do them again. So whenever you're drying your little gel, put it on wax paper so it doesn't get stuck. I forgot about that. Chinga la madre. Y'all see the shine from her top coat? It's shiny. Como con lo de la nieve ayer, for real. Ay, pinche nieve, pinche. Nieve, pinche cow. Moo. Oh, I made one bigger than the other, so now I have to make the other one a little bit bigger. Okay, so 
So let me just flatten the little ears a little bit. One of them has a little glitter. The bad thing about rolling these on your fingers is that whatever's on your finger, you're going to get on it. So I had a little glitter. That could be the bottom. Fuck it. Who cares? El cuernito. Something like that. Damn props to you. You can do this with your nails. I'm struggling. My favorite part of the cow is definitely the udders. It's an earring now. <laughs> Just flip the glitter over. Uh, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Is that the food good at Mama Por Dios? Oh, is the food good? Yeah, it was. I liked it. I would like to go again. Oh, shit. Did I not carry it? Mm, I forgot what I ate. I ate... Um, what did I get? We got a little bit of everything. We got skewers, like shrimp skewers. We got the esquite. We got some tacos de papa. I even got lobster tail, I think. Um, um, we got the little ice cream cart. So cute. Dude, I should go with these nails. Saturday, it's a date. Was it expensive? Um, I don't think it was that expensive. We ended up paying like 300 cookies, but it was three of us with our drinks and all of that. It was definitely worth the experience. I got a little duck drink with a little tub. Oh, ooh, ooh. little ear, little ear, where are you going? Let me flip. No, I've never been to Hook and Rio. Where's that at? Are you planning on adding some spots on the cow? Yes, but I'm going to finish the cow first. My man took me to 71 above in LA and it was 400 for us to. Is that the rooftop thing? Like, mijo, mejor me hubieras comprado nail supplies. All right. All righty, let's get these, these ears on. Si te quiere, entonces, Stacy, si te quiere, porque te llevo al, en un lugar carito. Fuck. It jumped. Ahora se me pintó azul. My little cuernito went into... Hold on, let me spray activator on this shit. It jumped into my gel. Eyebrows. Hold on, let me point them down. Ahí está la pinche vaquita. 
It's only seafood. I had it for the first time in VA and I moved to Bloomer had me dying three days. Oh hell no. It looks angry. It looks like a fucking piglet right now. Loki. Yes, it's a cool. Okay, let me make the little horns. Maybe like brown. Trust the process. Trust the process. So I'm going to do a little nubs. Yeah, Lenny's in here being a little bitch. Titi me pregunta que se tenía nadie. Maybe I should add more. Don't be a cold. I'll make the little horn bigger. I'm going to do them like this. I don't have gray. Little bitch. Stay. I guess I'm just gonna dry them and then I'll glue them on. That's the best way. It's a little baby cow, so we're gonna give a little baby horn. All right, let me cook that little pulguita. You have to do brown horns. Put one ear up and the other down. Ya se secaron. I can't move them anymore. I was going to move them. But it does not want to move anymore. I glued it. My little cow, you're so cute. Las orejas y los cuernitos. All right, look at the little baby cuernitos I made. Okay, cow, you're going to have to sit up, motherfucker. So one of the ears, I accidentally dropped it in the, in the blue gel. So that's why it's like that. Okay, so I'm going to do the cuernitos right here. Let me spray activator so that it can start drying by the time I put the bitch on there. I'm going to lay Dude, don't make me look stupid right now, you cuerno. The cow's like, no quiero. Mm, oh. oh my gosh, doesn't want to stay. Voy a llenar de glue la vaquita y el cuerno no se quiere quedar. Oh my god. What the fuck? I just lost the cuerno. It fucking fell. I need help. All right, there's one little cuerno. Let me see if I can find it. It fell to the floor. No mames, está bien chiquito el pinche cuerno. ¿Dónde cayó el puto? 
Um, oh, there it is. Oh my god, let me light this bowl real quick. I'm getting stressed. <laughs> Girl, imagine how I feel with this stupid little cow. The cuerno don't want to stay. Let me secure this cuernito through the back because motherfucker ain't going nowhere. Got me fucked up if you think you're going somewhere. <laughs> If you guys think you have anxiety, imagine me having to drop it, pick it up. Y lo con uñas, no manches. Ándale, pinche cuerno, mamón. Oh, I got stuck to my nail. It's getting stuck to everything but the cow. I'm stuck. The tweezers are stuck to the horn. Yes. He is on there. Okay, let me drench that bitch in glue. Don't you dare come off, you horn. <sighs> I can breathe now. You need to do a day in my life with three XL nails, girl. Everybody will make fun of me. All right, now let's paint the spots. I'm gonna have to hold the cow a little bit. Yes, I am a twin. All right, let me get my other palette up here. All righty, so. Oh my God, it's starting to look like a cow. Oh my God, that's gonna be so fucking cute. You know what it's missing? A fucking tail. I'm gonna put a mancha on the ear too. <laughs> and then it'll be here, little one. Oh, so cute. All right, hold on. Better hurry. Patrick gonna be mad at you for real. He's showering. It takes forever showering. I don't think I'm out of tail because that's gonna take longer. Oh, so cute. I'm put it on here. All right, I'm going to glue the bitch to my nail. Let me just scratch 
donde bailaba Kita. Right there. I'm gonna put a lot of glue because this cow needs to stay with mama. And then I'll put top coat while it's on me. I'm gonna I'm gonna do flowers on that one. Like just flowers instead of spots. I'm just gonna do flowers. Okay, the cow is on. I will secure it more shortly, but now it's time to do flowers. Again. But this time I'm gonna do them bigger. I'm gonna use the bigger side of the dotting tool. I could draw a tail, you're so smart. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, I'm missing pink. So when you guys retry this, you don't have to do the whole little cow and the udders. Look at them. It's a little bent forward. It's a little hunch. A little hunch. A swirly tail. So cute. I'm going to have to add that if I have time right now. That would be cute. Oh, I missed it. What you say? Girl, make time. Well, my son is taking a shower. We're supposed to um. Si se si se yo pase con ten. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna do the orange. I'm going to try to pick opposite colors to do the flowers on there. So check it out, my first flower. Let me zoom out a little bit so you guys can see my cow. All right, so the opposite color of green is pink. So, hoy aquí les voy a enseñar los opposite colors, if you guys don't know. You know, sons take long. Mm hmm. Es que se la anda jalando el mijo. Se la anda jalando a la mejor. Okay. Now yellow. Yellow for you, my friend. So 
Sorry guys, I can't see the comments right now porque aquí ando en la flor. Oh my gosh. So let me cure this really fast before I fuck shit up. This is my favorite set. I think it's going to be my favorite too. Everyone on this live needs to recreate this set with or without the cow. I'd love to see, be able to see what you are doing. Okay, hold on. We are making cow nails. But right now I am doing little flower petals. To match the other nails. Oh, what's the opposite color? Oh, it's green. Um, I made the cow with um sculpting gel. You could probably make it with acrylic too, but you gotta work faster. Figaro, Figaro, Figaro. Oh my God, that looks so cute. You know what? I'm probably gonna put a bell on this bitch. Jingle bam, jingle bam. Oh my god, I love this. Yes, a bell. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. I feel like it's missing something, probably some bling. What should I put on the tip? Let me try to make a tail. Wait, the curly tails are for pigs, no? <sighs> Love them. Buenas noches, Lay. Gotta get up early. Buenas noches. Thank you. I'm just gonna put random polka dots now just to give it some more color because I feel like it looks a little empty. Or should I put a few little black? It has black hairs on the top of the tail. Black spots. Cows have long skinny tails with a tail and yeah, black. Okay, I'm gonna add just a few little black, like three. Just the tip. Okay, some little pelitos. That right there is a um a fucking spot. Oh, I mean on that definitely was kind of necessary. Sorry guys if I'm moving. It's because I have you guys zoomed in. There. It just needed a little bit of black, huh? It's like, peekaboo, I see you. Can you put them black to the screen so I can screenshot? Yes, hold on, let me just cure this. I'll put a little tail right now after put the gel. What you like with the gel for your nail? 
What if I get a little eyelash and cut the strip off? That'd be funny. Funny as fuck. All right, let me prep my gel. Like with the gel for your nail. Okay, so here's my cow. Let me put gel. I'm just gonna put gel on the whole thing. What you like with the gel for your nail? It look nice. Like diamond in the sky. Um, do any of you guys think this was not gonna look like a cow? Like you just didn't see it until like I put the spots on. Like you're like, there's no way in hell that's a cow. Like no way. You wanna come see my cow? I'm gonna put gel on my cow too. <laughs> Does it look like a cow? Yes. It looks like a little plushy, huh? Mm -hmm. With the little udders. If anybody says this doesn't look like a cow, I'm gonna cut you. Why are you closing the door? Let's put top coat on all of it. I'm just not going to put top coat on the udders or the mouth. So it doesn't look like a charm like it came from China and shit. Like not that there's not anything wrong with that. But I need to show that I made it. Just wherever the gel's at. Like I made it bitch. It's handmade in the USA. Does it look like a cow? Just kidding. Look, you're about to get two chops to the throat, ma'am. <laughs> okay, let me clean my palette real quick. Two chops to the throat. What cow? Let me make the tail. Where you got your palette from. Everything that I'm using right now is available on my store. The link is on my bio. So um, it would be under the, the tools category. Oh wait, that's too big of a cow. I mean... the tail I swear if this fucking cow doesn't get a lot of legs we're about to throw it away because it's so darn cute we're gonna shove that fucking tail in there Can you guys see the tail? I'm gonna put the little hair right there. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Zule, please add the Versace Gold stickers to the website. Oh, Coco Bunny, I made a note on your order. 
I took them off. I took off the cherries because I wanted a, a cow. Now let me get the gold, the black one really fast. I just need to cure in here a little bit. I love them. Even without bling, they're looking so darn cute. Um, I've got an education from... I mean, I have a license, but I have taken classes before to learn different things. Obviously, this I learned by myself, but I have taken classes over the years. It's really important that you continue to learn different things. Pinche vaquita mamona, doesn't want a hairy, a hairy tail. Sorry, it's hard to, um, let me zoom it out. It's hard to record and do my nail. <laughs> the little tail. But it's some pinche piglet tail. Fuck it, the tail's there though. I'm taking this class. I'm 38. <laughs> I'm 30. I'm gonna be 31 in January. The tail looks cute. Thank you. Should I add some bling? I want to add a little bit of bling, but nothing too crazy because obviously the cow is the center of attention. We don't want to take anything away from it. I am a Capricorn. The Enero. I am 14. I, oh, the Enero. I was born in January 14. I like them just like this, to be honest. Add bling to the ear that has blue on it. Oh, I don't want to add anything to my, any bling to my cow itself. I don't want to make it look like weird, you know. It already looks a little weird without the bling. I was thinking maybe... To add a little bling in the Frenchie. Maybe in the cuticle area. I don't know. I need some diamond in there. At least like a cuticle. I need a bling bling in there. I need a bling bling. So let me just pop on my bling thing real quick. I'm not going to fuck them up. I promise. Just going to add a little bit of bling. Just because I need to sparkle on a f one finger at least. Where the hell is my stick of bling? Let's see. Oh, I know what I could do. I could just do like two diamonds on each nail. Maybe I should do a rainbow one. Like a color, a different color in each one. I do have some neon bling. Well, I'm gonna add one crystal. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm saying one. One only at a, right now. And then I'll add a neon one possibly. 
Who are you, Zulage? Is that in Gwen Crystal? Right now? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? It's like, it's not Zulage. She don't have a diamond. One little diamond. All right, now I'm going to add a little neon one. To my movie? No. Okay, let me see where my neon... Neon green... I'm going to get up from my chair. Oh my God, this looks so cute. Oh, you know where I have neon bling? In my scoops. My bling scoops. crystals that I have. Okay, I'm just going to pick a random color for each finger. I'm going to do orange on this one. I'm going to do Blue on this one. I'm gonna do um green. Tell me you sell these. Um the bling this bling box, yes, it is on my website. Um it should be in the rhinestone category. Um, let's see what else. I'm going to do purple on that one. Or pink. Let's see, whichever one comes out first. I guess pink. Oh my God, cute. I'm so obsessed with my cow, I swear. This one, I guess, will be the purple one. If I could find a purple one. Oh, yeah, it's right there. Oh, my gosh. That is so cute. Should I put one more? A, B one? Just a small one? Or do you guys think that's enough bling already? How much is the rhinestones? Mm, I don't remember how much they are. You would have to check on my website, girl, because I have so many items that I don't memorize them all. Perfect. One more. Yeah, so if I put one more, it's going to be an AB small one. One more. Enough. That sounds like a poll. So I'm going to do a poll. If you guys want me to add one more, you're going to go red. If you think that's enough, put the happy, the sad face, the crying face. So look at down here. Down here, I'm going to vote for one more, the happy face. If you guys want no more, then the blue face. Okay. It's, okay, girl, we already win. And let me just already pop that box out right here. Y'all were on it, on it. One more, one more, one more. Mm -hmm. Um, hold on, let me add a little bit more of these. The the acrylic base is luscious pink. 
Luscious Pink from Zule's Nails. Okay, one more crystal. One more baby. One more baby crystal. Así nomás bien simple. Ay, the cow is so cute. I'm going to cry if a little udder falls off. Let me do the little baby. Yep. Yep. If I would have had, oh, I do have small colorful ones. That's what I should have done, man. I should have done neon, AB, neon, but with different colors. I'm about to take them off and do it again. And just kidding. But just in case you guys do that, then um, that's an idea. If you guys recreate this. Oh shit, my blings are moving. All right, let me spray them with activator. Come on, you fucking bitch. Don't tell me that's no more. Good call. Are you going to add a purple bling box to the website or was that your personal box? A purple one? I don't think I have a purple. Actually, I do have one that's like purpley, like a, um, I forgot what it will be called. It's not purple, but I'll show it to you guys another day. I have to find it. Uh, girl, I would do it without the cow. Yes, <laughs> definitely. The cow is, is extra work, but when you guys recreate it, you could do it obviously without the cow. That's just something that I wanted to do today. I wanted to try something cute. That way. How long did it take me to make the cow? I'm not sure. We've been here for a little bit. Hi, Miriam. I want those nails. They're cute, huh? Look at the little cow. It took me quite a while because, girl, pinches orejitas se mandaban cayendo. Mm-hmm. So está. Las uñitas. So cute. Let me put on my anillitos for the finished look. I have a designated um cajoncito now for my rings. The cow I made it out of um sculpting gel. A ver si me cabe un anillo con la cow. Look, I use the sculpting gels. I have 18 different colors. Oh, shit. No tanto porque solo me fui por un momento and you were done. <laughs> ¿Qué andabas haciendo? Que no se te hizo tanto. I think I'm going to go look for the cow on Amazon. I don't have skills. A ver... I'm sure there's charms of cows. I need more rings. I need colorful rings. Are you going to make tiny foods tonight? No, I'm not going to make tiny foods because um, I promised my son we would watch a little TV before he goes to sleep. Right now he's still showering, so we'll have to leave the foods for another day. Yeah, I don't have any more rings, but check it out. The rings totally make it look nicer, huh? So this is a set of the night. Do you guys like yay or nay? I promise I won't get mad if you say nay, because definitely not for everybody. But so let me show you guys the inspo. This was the inspo. Did I nail it? Mm 
Wow. Yay, definitely yay, 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 yay. I love strawberry milk. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, guys. So, ya me voy. Thank you for hanging out with me. If you guys just got here, sorry, but we leaving already because we done. So take a little, um, take a little screenshot. I'm going to be posting them on my Instagram as well tomorrow. So you understood the assignment. Mm -hmm. I love them. I would do the cow with a green background like grass. <laughs> That's cute. Good night, everyone. See you guys next time. Sweet dreams. Don't forget to show me some love on this post when I post it tomorrow. Bye. Tomorrow.